What's going on guys? <clears throat> welcome back to the channel, or welcome to the channel. It's gonna be um, Tesla DMV FSD beta. Excuse me, I'm eating a little bit. Sour Patch Kids. Guilty. Now turn right onto Patrick Henry Drive. Trying a little bit of uh, a scenario here from the park position in a shopping center I thought it would make for um, an interesting challenge to see if we can begin like that and uh, go ahead and continue the rest of our drive great job with the merge and being able to recognize that there were park cars there and not moving cars Nice little uphill action here. Now turn right onto John Marshall Drive. <clears throat> Alright, so nice stop at the red light. Yep, you got it. Almost had to nudge it, but figured it out. In 500 feet, turn right onto Wilson Boulevard. All right, so so far so good. Hope everyone watching this is having a great day. Now turn right onto Wilson Boulevard. We are um, seeing some really good progress here with FSD, and um, I'm really excited for the new update. But a lot of good takeaways over here, so. In 500 feet, turn left onto Patrick Henry Drive. Let me know what you guys think. <clears throat> Feel free to drop a comment. Now turn left onto Patrick Henry Drive. Uh, would you sit behind the wheel of a self-driving car? One of my biggest questions these days. Wow. Because I'm telling you, some of those turns feel like a roller coaster. Um, you, you know, you're way more comfortable when you're in charge, but are you okay with the blue line? <laughs> Can you trust it? My advice would be to trust it and to be skeptical because if anything like variable wise in, in these driving conditions were wrong, um, I would not expect it to complete that maneuver or whatever. So always pay attention be ready look at that clock my speed perfectly don't catch a speeding ticket with autopilot it's an amazing thing but yeah pretty cool maneuvers back there it handled it flawlessly i gotta give it props on that i've seen it mess up before so i like to see when it does amazing all right so are on a little bridge here it's pretty cold out today 41 degrees I'm getting close to Thanksgiving now looking forward to the holidays happy holidays to everybody hope you all are enjoying um, or looking forward to the time off spent with family and friends uh, in 500 feet definitely looking forward to it and uh, yeah FSD doing a great job out here let me know if um, anybody's expecting a, um, a Tesla delivery. I'm trying to meet up with any um, beta drivers here in the uh, DMV. That'd be pretty cool. Um, I'm trying to cover as much area because I haven't really seen too much um, DMV 
beta testing going on so I hope that my car is providing some sufficient data and uh, that we are able to um, go with wide release here soon I'm really looking forward to uh, safety score Q being added uh, basically anyone who's paid for FSD being able to get it because uh, the more the merrier I think people will soon realize that not like FSD is like almost as important as your cell phone I know that's reaching a little bit but honestly like you get used to it after a while too just like you remember days without you know your smartphone you could live with it of course but once you had the smartphone you know think about it now you know I'm almost making those same analogies here with FSD it's like I'm not trying to spoil myself because it's in beta mode and I'm like always watching out for things like people just reversing out of nowhere um, but at the same time oh my gosh like it makes life it makes your drives like way more interesting a lot more fun um, you know it's um it's challenging at times too it takes a lot of patience but at the end of the day you know the data that goes back to tesla um you know this could help provide people who are incapable of driving to drive one day you know imagine a car without a steering wheel i know that sounds wild to even imagine or no brakes or pedals down there but it's pretty much happening here you know like I haven't really been in control this whole time. Oh no, so we, we made a bad move here. So FSD did put me in a auto uh, left only turn. Um, so what we're gonna have to do here is um, wait for the light to turn green and hope for it to make the correct move or else I will have to take over. Okay, so it did. It actually wasn't a left turn only lane. It was a... So, see, I should have known better because I hit the indicator. I should have never gone in that lane. Uh, good thing I didn't have to take over. But, yeah, the person behind me went straight too. So, we're good. Um, yeah, so fsd is a it's a it's a challenging task every day but it's actually like a rewarding task at the same time like you have to be really you know vigilant and pay attention but i mean like it's amazing that it's doing all this stuff for me you know um i'll tell you like a lot of people or pretty much everyone that i've let try this can't handle it to be honest like it's too much you know everyone's like will it break um you know for whatever reason they get scared or i don't know um maybe it's not for everybody but it definitely uh takes some getting used to and once you do you know it really like makes you think just like you know your cell phone did you know wow can't imagine the times before it like we have kids growing up today that only know you know days with their iPhone because they don't remember a time before it so they can't even imagine what it's like without it you know I think this technology is headed in the same direction but anyways I want to thank you guys for watching this video uh, hopefully you enjoyed it got to see some of the latest technology here with Tesla um, and uh, the FSD beta so um, hit that like button if you enjoyed the video please subscribe to Tesla DMV for the DC metropolitan area southern Maryland and northern Virginia we'll be bringing you uh, 4k content constantly so yeah thanks again for watching and hope you guys have a great day